Good evening. Bill 96 was tabled a year ago and was adopted by the National Assembly today. It is an update to Quebec's French language charter, Bill 101, and it's being criticized by both sides of Quebec's linguistic divide. The Liberals say it tramples on the rights of minorities. The PQ says it doesn't go far enough to protect the French language. The final vote on the bill was 78 votes for and 29 against. Now, Matt, the Premier had a message for the English-speaking community today. That's right. Francois Legault says there are some who are adding fuel to the fire, especially when it comes to access to health care services in English. The Premier wants to reassure the Anglophone community that it will continue to have access to English health care services moving forward, even with Bill 96 passed into law. But Francois Legault says it's his duty and responsibility to protect French, and he's confident Bill 96 is the way to go. The bill, as you mentioned, has faced heavy criticism, some who think the bill goes too far and infringes on rights. Now, Legault also talked about the changes that will come for English CGEPs. Legault says that capping the English CGEP growth is also a moderate measure that's been put in place. He's accusing the PQ of being too strict on that topic and the Liberals of not doing enough. Here's more now from the Premier. I really uh, want that we get uh, people together. I know that uh, a vast majority of Anglophones are against uh, the independence of Quebec, uh, and uh, they have to understand that it's a question of survival. If we don't take action to protect French, it's a matter of time. Uh, it, it, Quebec becomes a bilingual state it's a matter of time before we lose uh, the, the presence of French in Quebec. Now, Matt, not all the parties voted for Bill 96. That's right. The Liberals and the Parti Québécois both voting against Bill 96, but both parties are really on opposite sides of the spectrum in terms of reasons why. The Liberals, we've known for quite a while now, are not, we're not going to be voting in favor of Bill 96. They're against the bill. They believe it goes too far and that it's really going to hurt the Anglophone community. They don't, the party doesn't like what the Legault government is doing with regards to English CGEPs. Now, the PQ on the other side of things believes that Bill 96 does not go far enough. The party says this is simply a repeat of what the Liberals did in 1974 with Bill 22. That was the official language act passed by the Bourassa government. The PQ is also not happy that Bill 101 was not applied to CGEPs. We'll hear now from the leader of the PQ, followed up, followed up by the Liberals. We hear Anglophones when they say it's a lot of administrative measures, a lot of blurry uh, statements in the law, um, I think uh, it, it is a, a, a genuine, uh, a legitimate criticism. So it's not going far enough, but it's also creating burdens that are unproductive because it doesn't create any protection for the French language. The reaction from the community, the reaction from, uh, from the immigrant community, the reaction from Francophones who realize okay, we may not have access to uh, an Anglophone CEGEP anymore, um, is, uh, is quite straightforward and quite honest and quite direct. And uh, so once that bill has been studied, once we understand, once everybody understood uh, all of the repercussions, it became, uh, it became plainly obvious to, to us and to everyone else that this bill uh, does not accomplish what it sets out to accomplish. Now, the Quebec Community Groups Network had some really strong and harsh words for Bill 96 after it was passed. The QCGN says, quote, that Bill 96 is the most significant derogation of human rights in the history of Quebec and Canada. And the QCGN says there will be a rally against Bill 96 on Thursday night in Montreal.